Hi Libra, this is my channel Psychic Love Tarot. Welcome to my channel. On this channel, I do tarot readings for the people from all around the world. So you can subscribe to my channel if you like what I do. Right now, I'm going to do a reading for Libra people that what you should expect in the month of December 2023 overall. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull three cards out for the first 10 days, three cards for the middle 10 days and three cards for the last 10 days of December. So watch the video till the end so you get all these messages. Uh, I'll use tarot deck, gypsy cards and wisdom of the oracle in this reading. Okay, so let's start uh, your reading Libra and I'm not doing personal readings anymore. Uh, so the personal readings are closed now. I would recommend that uh, you um, uh, stay in the process of shuffling because uh, it helps the energies to connect more in my experience. Okay, first 10 days of December. Messages for Libra. First 10 days of December. Messages for Libra. First 10 days of December. Messages for Libra, first 10 days of December. Messages for Libra, first 10 days of December. Okay. Messages for Libra, first 10 days of December. Messages for Libra, first 10 days of December. Okay. Messages for Libra, first 10 days of December. Messages for Libra, first 10 days of December. Okay, uh, so first of all, we have four of wands. So that's uh, about stability. I think there was some issue in your relationship or your marriage or some kind of property or house or some there was some conflict because we have anger and frustration uh, with that with this four of wands uh, so uh, basically uh, uh, i think something uh, in your life it can be anything actually uh, but something which was stable uh, became dicey or it, it it's it's like dicey right now uh, before december um, and uh, uh, you have been uh, really guarded about it because we have nine of wands in the shadow uh, and something was taken away from you or you like we have thief in the shadow uh, so maybe it was like uh, something went wrong something went down or something is not going uh, good it can be a relationship it can be a project or a job or house issue or something like that i think in the beginning of december that will resolve because we have mending after that that's actually very positive and i think libra whatever the problem is going on in your one situation i feel there is a situation in your life which is not going well so the, that situation will uh, the first part of December you will be completely into uh, mending that situation into sorting that out into uh, clearing the air and um, making it right or things like that uh, so um, so it's a very positive energy and I think quickly uh, that situation is gonna be resolved um, it can be a reconciliation it can be a uh, like uh, sorting things out in some way so if there is a matter going on which is not sorted out that will be sorted out in the first part of December and then we have milk and honey in the shadow so it's basically pleasure joy happiness everything good so if you are stressed out or frustrated or angry in some uh, issue or in some situation which is not working out for you that's gonna start working out for you and uh, um, you'll be uh, sort uh, you'll sort it out things will be sorted out automatically even and then you'll be very happy joyful and uh, like pleasure for some of you maybe you'll have 
physical closeness, intimacy with somebody. Okay, middle 10 days. Messages for Libra. Middle 10 days of December. Messages for Libra. Middle 10 days of December. Too many cards, so I'll not take them. Messages for Libra. Middle 10 days of December. Messages for Libra. Middle 10 days of December. Messages. I'll take it. Messages for Libra. Middle 10 days of December. Messages for Libra, middle 10 days of December. Okay. So first we have Hermit. So now in the middle 10 days, something is going to happen. And uh, that's different from the first 10 days. So it can be all together in some other situation. Because in some situation, things can go wrong because we have misfortune and widower in the middle. So in some situation, things can go a little bit wrong. It can be entirely another situation or for few of you, maybe the same situation. I don't know about that. Uh, and you will detach yourself from the situation. You'll detach yourself or maybe you'll think that, okay, this is repeating and this is the same uh, pattern, the toxic pattern. Uh, so so you'll, detach, you'll detach from some kind of situation. And then we have orphaned. So uh, I don't know because th these are general readings. You cannot pinpoint the exact situation, but yeah, there is an energy in one situation. I don't know what situation is that. Maybe it's entirely a different situation. Uh, in one situation, there will be some trouble and uh, you will be uh, a little bit down about it and you will detach yourself uh, from some situation. But the positive thing is that we have baby in the shadow. So uh, there is also gonna new uh, gonna be a new beginning uh, in some area of your life, which is good. So uh, maybe an ending in something or and a new beginning in something. It's, it's a mix kind of dicey kind of time, the middle part. Uh, there will be challenges in some area and there will be a new fresh start in some area. And that start will be communication, page of swords in the shadow. Some kind of communication is going to start with somebody, positive communication. So it, it will be balanced. There will be one area in which there will be a little bit down Thing and challenges and in the other area there will be something starting something fresh something good something positive so yeah something like that now last 10 days of December messages for Libra last 10 days of December messages for Libra last 10 days of December Messages for Libra, last 10 years of December. Messages for Libra, last 10 years of December. Messages, oops. Messages for Libra, last 10 years of December. I'll also take this fluent part and another card. Okay. Uh, messages for Libra, last 10 years of December. Messages for Libra. Last and December. Okay, that's actually good and positive. First, we have magician in the shadow. So uh, something will be trying to start. Something will be trying to manifest for you. A good start, a new start. But 
you will not be trusting that eight of swords. Like you'll be on a verge that, okay, should I go for it? Should I not go for it? Uh, whatever it is. You'll, you, uh, because you'll not be impulsive at all. You'll not be emotional at all. You'll be very logical about it. You'll be brainy about it. Uh, but you'll be, you'll not be sure about jumping in. So, uh, you can say not trusting the situation completely. But then we have house, sweetheart and money. Uh, so, all these uh, uh, energies are positive. So, so stability. Uh, it can be in work, it can be in love, marriage, anything. So, uh, it's, it's like, uh, it, it, it can be, okay, that's a very specific message for a few of you because we have marriage in the shadow. So, maybe, uh, for a very few of you, maybe it will be an opportunity of marriage. Maybe somebody proposing you, maybe somebody showing interest in getting settled with you. It's for a very few of you. So you'll be considering it, I would say. Uh, so that's for some of you. And for the others, I think uh, if there are problems going on in your marriage, maybe your spouse will be trying to sort things out and you'll not be trusting the situation, but you'll still be wanting to uh, sort things out. Uh, or in a relationship or in even in a business uh, venture or uh, a job environment or a work environment. It can be in any environment, but it's going towards positivity. The good thing is whatever your situation is, take it as it resonates with you, but it's, it's, uh, it's going to go towards positivity. Uh, it's just you will be doubtful. It's not the circumstances will be all right. Circumstances will be good. You will have, uh, you'll have it in front of you. And then we have here and now. Again, very positive. So you'll decide that, okay, let's see where it goes. You'll not say no. You'll not say complete yes. You'll not jump in. You'll be wise about it. And you'll see that, okay, let's start it and uh, let's see where it goes, like going with the flow. So a positive end to uh, a mix. I, I think it's a mixed kind of month for you. Things will be good also, but there will be some challenges also, but then those challenges sorting out uh, and you getting clarity about that in the same month. And... Uh, by the end of the month, you'll be relaxed, uh, even before that. And uh, you'll be confident, relaxed, and you'll feel that, okay, things are all right. And let's see where it goes. Please hit the button like if you like the video and give me a thumbs up. You can subscribe to my channel if you like what I do. And thank you so much for watching the video. Stay blessed always.